What up everyone, it's your man xman87 here bringing you another SDCC Marvel Legends video and what I have for you today is the Marvel Legends Brown Suit Wolverine reveal. Before we get into everything, if you could please leave a thumbs up like rating on the video, it'll help show your support for my channel and I greatly appreciate it. Now with that said, let's talk about it. Earlier today, Dan Yoon showed off this photo on his X account captioned game. And as you can see, it is the retro arcade X-Men roster off against the retro arcade Sentinels. But the big reveal coming from this is that brown suit Wolverine, a new brown suit Wolverine that's in the pinless mold and i believe it's reusing the x-men 97 body from what it looks like it does have the x-men 97 claws at first i thought oh this is the x-men 97 brown suit wolverine but then when i look at the x-men 97 one he had that red and black x-men belt this has the gold belt buckle like he does in the comics so it's not the x-men 97 for sure and I'm thinking the only thing I can think of how this guy will be offered is that rumored Secret Wars wave, which uh, I hope has the Beyonder in it. But it would make sense for this Wolverine to be in that Secret Wars wave because, correct me if I'm wrong, I believe that was his first toy ever in the brown suit. Mattel crushed it with that line back in the day and hopefully they'll be in the Secret Wars retro card packaging. That would be a neat touch, but... Yeah, as you can see, I am feeling it. This is exactly what I wanted is a pinless brown suit Wolverine. And it's a lot lighter in deco with the brown. So it's a lighter brown than that Juggernaut Wave 1. I mean, they went with a lighter brown deco, I believe, with the retro card, the Superheroes retro card back in 2017. But this one looks to be a lot brighter than that. He does have the X-Men 97 Wolverine claws. Uh, they could be a little flimsy. I would have preferred the movie Logan claws. Those are the best ones, man. But still, I love that X-Men 97 Wolverine, and <laughs> I'm gonna love this. Uh, it's just impossible to hate the brown suit Wolverine. And so he's got a pretty cool looking head sculpt. He does have a smirk, and I think I said that recently, that I would like to see a Wolverine... Uh, masked Wolverine with the smirk, you know, so I could display him when he's looking like a little smart ass. But uh, yeah, uh, it looks good. Hopefully, he does have alternate heads. I do want an angry head or at least a neutral head. I don't need him to have an unmasked head. We have enough of those that we could pop onto this body, but at least if this gives us a good, what, what I'd say, three Wolverine heads with different expressions, I'm so down for that. Regardless, I'm still down for this. I think it's safe to assume by now that this is what Dan Yoon was saying that was his favorite Wolverine figure in the line this year. So yeah, I just wanted to make this quick video update for you guys. Is the brown suit Wolverine your favorite costume for the character? If not, let me know what costume is. Also, did you secure your Retro Arcade Sentinels 2-pack yesterday before they sold out? They limited it to 5, so I got myself 5. That'll be like 10 total figures to play with. But man, let me tell you, did it benefit to be a Premium Pulse member? Because once they went up to be available for everyone else at 6pm, they sold out <laughs> real quick, man. So I was very happy to secure mine. And I don't think they'll go up for pre-order again, judging from previous Army Builder packs they sold out before, like Hellfire Club and such. If they do offer them again, they'll probably paint them in different colors since they appeared in different colors in that game. But now I kick it back to you. What do you think about this new pinless brown suit Wolverine figure? Do you think it will be in the rumored Secret Wars wave? Rectangular has been pretty spot on with his leaks after seeing some of these SDCC reveals. List down your retro Secret Wars wave wish list. I honestly don't care who's in it as long as they give me my freaking Beyonder figure. Comment below, let me know, we'll chat about it. Thanks for watching another Marvel Legends video. Please follow me on Instagram if you haven't already at xman87. Hit the notification bell so you always know when my latest videos are up. Share and subscribe if you're new. See you on the next video. Peace, peace.